Hey guys, it's Ross, and I'm looking at my alliums today. I love alliums. They're some of my favorite foods. It's really one of my favorite food groups. And you can see that right here we're looking at my Egyptian walking onions, and right now they're putting out seed heads. Um, putting out these bulbs, I guess. Not seed heads. They're putting out these bulbs, these garlicky bulbs, or onion-like bulbs, on the top of their the plant it's just very it's very strange how these work but they'll bulb up like this and then they'll fall over at some point this gets too heavy the stems get a little weaker and uh, they'll propagate themselves that way but for me I don't really want them to do that um, I'd rather control where this goes so I've I've taken some of these off and I'm gonna plant these wherever I want in the yard and I want this this little area here to be a nice little dense space of them because I really love this plant. Uh, it has many, I guess, culinary uses in terms of you can eat the entirety of the plant. You know, you can eat the bulb here, you can eat the stems, they're like a green onion, and then you can eat the, the actual onion that's down in here. You can see that, and that is, it's all really damn good. Uh, and it propagates itself you know, it's going to be a perennial here in zone 7. It's just a no-brainer of a plant. It's so easy. Uh, you know, they're not going to be invasive. They're not going to take over your yard, but they will propagate themselves. And at some point, I'll have many, many of these to harvest. And uh, that's what I'm hoping for. So, anyway, guys, I just wanted to share that little piece of information with you and what I'm going to be doing with these next. And, uh, yeah. Take care, guys. I'll see you for the next one.